Uh, hello, uh, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it's February 24th, 2019. It's almost 7 a.m. in the morning. And uh, you, may have, you may have noticed, well, if, well I, was I was streaming video before there was a YouTube, before there was whoever you named before that. And I, as they came along, I gave each of them, uh, you know, a try. I was streaming, had to, back when you had to stream video, I was, back in the very beginning, there wasn't anybody streaming video except there was a camera aimed at a coffee machine someplace on the internet and a camera aimed at a vending machine, I believe. And then I started streaming video from my own computer, which was not very powerful back then. Everybody's, nobody's computer was, personal computers were that powerful. So I was around streaming video before you. And when uh, I joined YouTube when they started in 2005, and I've got a lot of videos on YouTube, but I haven't done very much streaming. And I've actually, uh, having breakfast, by the way. Hang on a second here. Let's see, can you see that? I don't want my, I don't want to have uh, olive juice down on my G910. So I've gone through a whole bunch of different streaming software programs uh, in the recent years, trying them out. And uh, I guess it kind of looks bad, haven't I? I use that to wipe my nose. It kind of looks bad, I guess, sitting out. I'm not using it as toilet paper in here. I'm using it as, like, tissue. Um, so I've been trying different kinds of... Well, I've been trying since YouTube okayed streaming for people. I've been trying out different things. And I did try out... Oh, it's on my computer. I did try out OBS, and it worked. Then I stopped using it for some reason, and I've paid for several programs, tried several programs, used them. Right now, <clears throat> I'm not live streaming this, but I'm using... Manicam, which will live stream, and it, it works well, and I should just keep using it, but I like to keep kind of looking for the perfect program, and all I need to do is learn how to use one correctly, you know. Excuse me. I've got a computer, an i5, PC. It's got 16 gigabytes of memory. Uh, I'd naturally like to have, you know, an i7 or something. Uh, I'm not interested in streaming gaming. Unless I just did it for a couple minutes to say, here's what I'm doing right now, you know. I am interested in live streaming. And I live streamed in the past before uh, YouTube, 24 hours a day, seven days a week for weeks or months in Missouri, in Orlando, Florida, and Miami, and all types of places. But, so I would like to live stream. And I know OBS is... Uh, uh, one of people are saying to use, and I've tried using it, and I actually used it. I actually live streamed with it. Then I, uh, used it, had a different computer, a different setup. I'm, I've tried using it last two times and had some problems. And I know there are lots of videos on YouTube uh, 
a lot of videos on YouTube where they show you how to do it. Even there's a guy that has it, and I don't mind paying money for my support. Uh, different people for you know pay for software stuff. I don't mind pay. I don't have a lot of money. I'm on a limited income, but I don't mind donating and paying for uh, stuff. But I am not interested in spending days or hours learning how to do something. I, hey, I'm old. <laughs> I, I have limited, you know, limited time. I don't want to become an expert in uh, OBS. And uh, when I, when that time I could have spent looking at pornography or something. I'm kidding, of course. Uh, I've got an NVIDIA card I've had, well in the past since I've been having computers for so long, I've had in the past a lot of video cards, <clears throat> but I'm not into the really, really expensive video cards like my grandson is, grown grandson for gaming and stuff, and I'm not into really gaming. I play Civilization VI a little bit, whatever the current, you know. Uh, I may get the new or the edition that's just out now. Here in a few days, maybe I'll order that and get it in, install it. But I'm not interested in uh, doing gaming really. But I, I want. Um, uh, to live stream. Um, and OBS, I have it on my computer and I may have to go back to it. I also have Manicam, which works fine. And uh, probably something else. But I've been seeing on my computer for, I'm not sure for how long. Better eat these before they get too cold. I, uh, when my computer boots up, it, you know, pops up a thing, G-Force, and shows you the key to hit or something, rather to enter G-Force. Uh, I guess this is, so I just installed it. it. You know, it's on the menu here. Let's see, go down. But when I clicked it, it was actually then it, you know, it was it was here. Let's see. Was it GeForce? Let's see. I've been listed under something else. What was it? Oh, Nvidia. Okay. So. So we have 3D Vision Photo Viewer. I have no idea what that is. 3D Vision Preview Pack. I have no idea what that is. Okay, this is still, what was it? Oh, by the way, if you look down here, you can see OBS, you know. So I clicked this, but it actually went ahead and installed it. It was on, showing that, but I clicked it and installed it. So this is what I have. And so this uses the, the NVIDIA. You have to have an NVIDIA card for this to work. But I think if you have a, what's the other one, G-Force or, no, I think that's part of NVIDIA. Whatever the uh, Radon, Radeon. I think that's it. Uh, if you have that, you can uh, get a program, I guess, like this for, th for their. So I just installed this. I'm not going sure what's going to happen because I've got not streaming but I have Manicam recording this. So let's see what we have here. Home. Drivers. Okay, let's here go to settings I guess. Okay, general. NVIDIA GeForce. That's the version I have here. 3.17 Point zero point one twenty six. Enable experimental features. I'm going to not do that right now unless I have to. 
in-game overlay. Easily record videos, take screenshots, play cooperative, and broadcast your... Press control, control Z to share your game play or uh, other settings. Alternate Z, wait a minute. Alt Z. I may need that. Notify me of updates. Uh, automatically download driver updates and let me choose when to install. I don't know. I've had trouble. I think a lot of people have when you get a new NVIDIA driver. Everything works, you know, working fine with my computer. And then I install a new NVIDIA driver. Okay, I have the uh, GTX, thanks to my grandson, 760 now. And I have, you know, you can see 16 gigabytes of memory in the computer. And I guess it shows 1920 by 1080, so I can do that, I guess they're telling me. That's a game opti optimization. I don't really want to optimize for... Let's <clears throat> see, I have an Intel Pentium G Series Core 2 quad core i3 i5 okay i don't know uh that's saying i7 i don't have all those i guess this is what it okay i guess i can not pay attention to this right stream your system to nvidia shield okay i don't know what nvidia shield is got a thing that goes there and then uh tells you what you need. I want to stream my what I'm streaming, it will not be gaming directly to YouTube live. Virtual reality, not ready. My computer's not ready. I'm not ready for it either, you know. Okay. Let's click on this. Redeem account. Okay, right now I'm afraid I'm gonna drag this over here. I don't want to show account and then have it show my password or something. So let me go over here and see what it says. Well, let me click redeem first. Well, that's popping up over here. <laughs> okay, there's where I can log into NVIDIA. Do I want to... I guess log in with uh, <clears throat> Google. So let me drag this over here. I guess open up this full screen, by the way, here. Since I'm not doing anything else, maybe change cameras. Okay. Um, I'm going to log in with Google. Two Google accounts, you know. So this is logging in, you know, NVIDIA is going to use my okay, I don't have a promo code. I'm not sure why I need a promo code. I think they want me to use like their NVIDIA. Okay, I don't have a promo code. I entered the thing that. Uh, okay, let's just go to my profile, which is probably my Google profile. Yeah. Preferences, which is my. Person. Okay, I think we can forget this. So, um, drag this back over here, I think. Or did I, uh, okay, I don't have to worry about that. 
So, uh, desktop notification, okay. General, account, personal information, member since 20, May of 2018, games, games found, shield, I think this is, must be NVIDIA's, whatever they want to do instead of, okay. Allow your PC to stream games to the Shield devices. What neck are Shield devices? Okay, I'll turn this on. Anybody ever hear of NVIDIA Shield TV? It's essentially streaming video played for the modern living room. Never heard of it. Never heard of it. Don't want it. Okay. Uh, Okay, I'm not sure what button I clicked up here. Broadcast live, I think we're close. Press alternate. Plus one to save a screenshot. So, uh, this must be connect, H-U-D, not sure what that is, layout, must be like the screen, keyboard shortcuts, recordings, broadcast live, highlights, audio, capture, notifications, privacy control. Okay, um, like I'm afraid now if I hit something, it's going to uh, interfere with this recording. If it does, then I'll stop it. Come back later with another uh, Okay, let's I don't want to do connect. Let's see what HUD layout is. Apparently that's the screen. Position, position, looks like camera positions. Okay, um, we'll go back. Keyboard shortcuts. Okay, there's a bunch of keyboard shortcuts. Okay, I can't print them, but I could do a screen. Let's see. Push to talk all these, okay. Back. Recordings, this must be where my recordings will be saved if I'm saving recordings. Back. Okay, broadcast live, okay, audio. Let's go down here. <clears throat> okay, they have the correct microphone listed, although I'm using it with this other. Volume, create a single track. Okay, that sounds good. Okay, that's for, rec for uh, audio. Capture. Okay, this is good. Looks like it lets me pick, you know, the uh, type of, how many frame rates and that type of stuff, bit rates.
instant replay link. Must be that somebody is watching this on, I'm guessing the G4 Shield or whatever that is, that you can uh, jump back. In game, let's see. Resolution. Okay, I think I should go with 1080p. Oh, okay. And 60 frames a second. Okay, I don't think we're going to need the ability to jump back. Okay, notifications. Audio. Okay, we did that. Create a single track. Back. Okay, now when I hit this, it may be a problem because I'm recording. I'm not live streaming, but let's see what happens when I do broadcast live. Okay, wait a minute. So this is... Okay. Live, let your, let your live stream broadcast your gameplay on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Okay, so destination. Facebook, hell no. Twitch, whatever that is, no. YouTube, yes. Okay, quality, high, I can go with that. Resolution, I want to go with 1080, 60 frames a second. Custom overlay, so it looks like up in the, uh, so we're going to do, let's see, we don't want to do this server, do we want to do, I don't know, let's, we'll leave it set to that. This is custom overlay, so I guess one's going to be the camera. Do I want to do... I don't have to put the camera right in there. I could do like I do now. And just pick the one I want on there and drag it around. So there's three empty spots. I want one to be. Okay, let's pick empty slot one. And make that the camera. Let me switch here. Okay, I can't get to that. Oh, I can down here. No, I can't. Okay. Okay, let's say empty slot one is going to be. Okay, custom overlay. Okay, I don't want a custom overlay. Okay, let's go back. Okay, let's see what number two is going to be. Same thing. This is, uh, looks to me like this is, okay, let's just say I don't need that. Huh. Back. Broadcast live. Kick back to 720p, didn't it? Oh, I see, because it's on. I guess what I need to do is figure out just how to start this thing. Okay, wait a minute. Let's see. Camera here. Camera on. Alternate F6 for camera on. Alternate F6 camera on. Let's see. Camera on. Alternate F6. 
Didn't ask me which camera, but okay. Always on. Okay, gallery. Over in F1, I already put that down, didn't I? Yep. Record, not recording, not broadcast. I think if I clicked on this now, I think we would start broadcasting live to YouTube. If I disappear, you'll know why. Start, okay. Start is uh, alternate. F8. I got a feeling we're going to have a crash here, but let's see what happens. Do you want to turn on desktop capture and start broadcasting? Yes, I do. Okay. YouTube. Not currently logged in at a title. Let's see. Sign in with Google. Okay. I think what I need to do is, uh, at this point, stop this recording and uh, come back here and then try to uh, go ahead and do a live broadcast using GeForce NVIDIA. Don't touch the mouse. Oh, we're not F one. Okay. Okay, where are you? Okay, stop recording. Okay, I thought I was already recording this, so you missed out on all the fun. I had a heck of a time stopping this live video. Uh, just kidding. then it was showing like it was trying to load to people. I went in and tried to delete it, wouldn't let me delete it. I even, you know, rebooted my computer and I uninstalled just now the uh, NVIDIA software for, for that. And uh, I went in and uh, made the video private, it still showed to people trying to load, you know. So I moved it to private. Was that it? See, private. What was the other option? Okay, damn. Oh, my memory is going. My brain cells are dying. Uh, 10 most dangerous homes in the world. Wow. I wouldn't be able to sleep there. Um, oh, let's see. My channel. Uh, let's see. Beta Studio. It should show up in live videos, but show up as uh, now not. Let's see. Let's see videos, because I moved it from, okay, I think I moved it from unlisted, which didn't prevent it from being seen to, let's 
see, here we go. Okay, shows it as live. Shows it as unlisted. But I can't delete it. But it's not showing to you all, so. Uh, so what am I going to do now? Uh, UBS, God, I hate to mess with it. I've messed with it in the past. I was one of the first people to be playing with, around with it when it first became available. For live streaming, what should I use? Manicam? Why did I decide not to use Manicam for live? I had to have a reason. You know, here it is. I'm recording now. Here's, you know, clicking on for live streaming. Why have I decided that I didn't want to use it for live streaming and I wanted to use something else for live streaming? I don't remember. That was a few hours ago, right? Anyway, thank you very much for watching.